What's up Canada? Kyle Hebert here and it's my first men's national team call up. I was born uh, just outside of Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada, in a small town called LaSalle. Um, when I grew up, I always had a ball at my feet. I loved to play. Um, Soccer is a beautiful game where there's no, no boundaries to entry. Like, all you need is a ball. You don't even need anyone to play with. So at a young age, I, I found myself always gravitating towards, towards playing soccer. Um, through the youth career, um, you know, just enjoyed my time. And then once I got to high school, I was in uh, National Development Center in Winnipeg, coached by Rob Gale. And I was also playing on WSA Winnipeg, a team uh, in USL2, coached by Eduardo. And, and those two guys and two teams had a big impact on my soccer journey before I went off to college at Missouri State University, which didn't go the way I had planned. I had planned on graduating, hopefully turning pro, back-to-back uh, -back knee injuries wiped out the first two years of my college career. Um, and I was sidelined and it was, uh, it was a depressing time, but I had faith um, that God had a plan for my life, for my soccer career. Um, I ended up staying at Missouri State until the end of 2021. And then I signed with St. Louis City's second team for all of 2022 was the first guy from the second team to get signed to a first team deal part of the way through 2022. Um, really special moment for myself, uh, for my wife Cassidy, for my parents, for my family, for all the coaches and players who have played alongside me and inspired and encouraged me on my journey. And then 2023 has been a whirlwind. We're, we're four games into the MLS season, undefeated so far. I scored my first MLS goal two games ago and I'm honored and blessed to be here representing Canada. I've had a dream since I was a little kid to represent Canada at the World Cup. And for many years, it was like, oh, Canada's not in the World Cup, you know? And, and I was so far off that dream. And, and just seeing, you know, all that Canada soccer accomplished um, 2022 and before to qualify for the World Cup and, and knowing we're gonna have a spot in the 2026 World Cup, that's a, that's a big goal of mine. But along the way, I'm just focused on taking it day by day and just enjoying the process of, of getting better and getting to know a lot of these guys.